Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to an episode of the Tipsy Pickle. I know it's been a super long time and I'm sorry for the wait. Please forgive me. Um, you know, please continue to share these videos. I realize that they're few and far between at the moment, but that's only because I'm on a crazy schedule and I haven't felt like I've been all that funny. So, my confidence has been lacking in the comedian area. So, Apart from that, I'm here to tell you a story. I don't have a beer to review, so uh, the tipsy pickle aspect of this is going to be not so tipsy, but hopefully funny. Okay, so um, it's a story that happened just the other day, okay, and it took place right in this room. So I'm setting the scene. Here we are. Here we are in the room, my bedroom. But I was on the computer doing a little surfing of the web, the interwebs like this. Anyway, that's me typing on the keyboard. And uh, I, I was um, going to go downstairs and, and get a little snack, a snick snack to eat, obviously, as, as that is typically the case. But as I was walking, I get to the edge of my bed and I see something out of the corner of my eye, kind of do a little bit of a movement, okay? And, you know, it has to be something of um, pretty good size to get your attention out of your perifs, okay? And so I look, it catches my eye. And uh, before I continue the story, I'm gonna interject. Everyone has that thing that is it terrifies them, okay? Um, whether it be clowns or dolls or snakes, Ryan Puskis, or um, for me personally, I am absolutely terrified of spiders, okay? Whether or not that was a good thing that I told all of YouTube that's what terrifies me, I don't know. I guess we'll see. But basically, there on my bed skirt was a giant spider. <gasps> oh God. Anyway, so the spider was huge. And I mean, it was that big, okay? Had to be pretty big to catch my, my attention, right? So the, the terrified portion of me, you know, has this panicky heart attack stroke all at once and um, the other terrified portion of me is thinking holy mackerel I need to find something bigger than this and crush it before it gets away because that'd be that'd be even worse so I go to my closet and I grab a tennis shoe you know a spider's worst enemy and you know how you like do the sneak up on a spider? Like you're like, ooh, you can't have the shadow over the spider because the shadow is going to scare it and it's going to run. So you have to kind of like come at it at an angle. Anyway, so I'm like moving super slow. And I can feel myself getting closer and I'm starting to shake real bad. And as I go to hit the spider, okay, I kind of, I, I don't, I'm not confident enough when I go to smash the spider. So when I lift up, the spider, it's like curled up, you know, how they get whenever they're dead. <laughs> anyway, and it's kind of hanging there on my bed skirt with one little spider leg, okay, and it's hanging there. And as I like pull the shoe away, because I think it's dead, the little sucker poofs out like it was playing dead, the jerk. Seriously, anyway, so it goes from like curled up nasty to poof, okay? And it like starts running with its little spider legs. And uh, oh man, so I like, you know, go into freak out mode where I'm like hitting just at my oh, my bed skirt just as wildly as I can because I'm, I'm terrified that I'm not going to get this before I have to go to bed. 
So I lift up my bed skirt, and there's no spider body, no corpse. And, uh, at this point, I'm almost in tears because I know that it was over by that edge of the bed, and I'm going to have to go to bed at some point. So... I'm looking in that area, but I'm I'm too scared. Oh god, it just gave me chills. Anyway, I'm too scared to actually like lift stuff up and really search for it because if it like comes out running and charges me or creeps on me or crawls on me, there is no way. Oh god. It's giving me a ooh, ooh, heebie jeebies. Anyway, so um that's my story. The good thing is, the next day, I found it, and it had died from its previous injuries. So, just so everyone knows, the spider is dead. If anyone here is uh, a subscribed um, individual to my channel and you have a special connection to spiders, I'm so sorry, but uh, that little spider, excuse me, big spider, found itself in the wrong bedroom, okay? I'm about to change my YouTube channel name to Amanda Carter Spider Killer. Okay? Maybe, maybe something cooler. Amanda Carter Spider Hunter. Oh! Anyway. <laughs> so, um, there's no, uh, no words to describe that feeling when you have to go to bed knowing there's a giant spider in your room. I tried to sleep here, had to go downstairs, so I actually slept on the couch that night. So, uh, yeah. Yeah, ooh. Anyway, that was my story. I hope it was kind of funny. It wasn't funny at the time. I literally almost cried about it. Um, oof. Oh, I hate them. I hate them so much. But anywho, anywho, I'm going to go about my day. Hopefully this was entertaining, and hopefully I get another video up here shortly. I might even go through my little video history and see if I have, like, a beer review that I thought wasn't funny and upload it for you so that uh, you have a Tipsy Fickle video for you guys because um, I've really been dropping the ball, and I'm over it. Time to step up my game, folks. But anyway, so thank you guys so much for watching. Please share, please subscribe, and uh, cheers. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.